Well, we have been talking about it for weeks now. The Oakland A's moving to Las Vegas. But today, Bally's, who announced that binding agreement with the A's to take over the site of the Tropicana, well, they kind of backpedaled a little bit. 8 News Now investigator Kyle Payne joining us in studio to explain. Kyle? Denise, you got it. Yesterday, Bally's and the A's announced a binding agreement. And we reported that if it goes forward, the trap will very likely be demolished. But today, Bally's came out with a two-page Q&A, saying plans are only, quote, in the very preliminary stages and not finalized for a ballpark. I think that there's a greater likelihood that it happens than not. Clark County Commissioner Jim Gibson, in an interview you'll only see on 8 News Now, seems to know about as much today as he did a few weeks ago when we interviewed him then. Would you say economically, financially, this is a done deal? No. That was when the Oakland A's said they were tying up land on the other side of the strip, before the latest news that they might tear down and redevelop the Tropicana, which is owned by Bally's. And today, Bally sent out this two pages of Q&A, which was short on specifics and heavy on if. What's going on? Well, I don't know the answer to that. What Gibson does know is what we've been hearing for weeks, that the legislature needs to present a bill with specifics on how all this will work. That bill might materialize this week, and when it does, Gibson says the commission will evaluate, crunch the numbers, and see how the pieces all fit together. There's no answers. Well, I, I, I won't quarrel with you. Another person he won't quarrel with is this Clark County resident who spoke at today's council meeting. Is this going to be a burden on the, uh, the community and the taxpayers? Who pointed out the A's, who say they're expecting some 30,000 fans a game and 2.5 million people a year, are drawing historically low number of fans. Some of that might be because they're leaving, but it also might be because they have baseball's worst record, 9 and 34. If the ownership is going to spend a billion plus dollars to come here, they understand uh, that they have to have a team that is competitive to succeed here. In our interview, Gibson also said this deal with the A's, quote, cannot be a rope around our throats. He also told me whatever ends up at the Tropicana site needs to be a functioning, contributing part of that area of the strip. But in the end, he said, let's get about the business of funding and building a stadium. Denise.